Do you have a lost love? Yes, and I'm hoping that he's not gone forever. Fuck, yeah. Mm -hmm. Do you have a do you have a lost love like the one that got away? <sighs> Man. Um. No, not really. I don't. I don't think so. Make it look like you're thinking of someone. <laughs> Who are you thinking of? Her name is Carla. Josh. William. Ian. He was a German exchange student. I think I like had a crush on him until like seventh grade. I just was always really drawn to her. He was funny. Beautiful. Handsome. I felt like myself around him. Like as soon as she walked in the room, it was like electric. It was the first time that I felt truly understood by somebody. Yeah, I had never felt that way before. I was like, holy shit. Like, this is like what the movies are like. This is like the fucking rom-com. And I gave him chlamydia. I was planning on telling him that I liked him before I got the chance to tell him. He had gone to a birthday party and made out with the birthday girl and a guy that was there. And I was heartbroken. We actually had a, had a short fling and then I ruined it. Why did it end? I said something in an argument that I feel like couldn't go back from. I wasn't ready. She just up and took off on me. She's like, hey, by the way, I'm kind of done with you. They had to move. Bad timing, I guess. Timing never worked. I was engaged and uh, she came out. We had planned to be long distance, but then they kind of got cold feet. I was just like, all right, let's do this. And he's like, you know what? I don't know if I'm ready. You hope? Someday it works out. Um, yeah, I do. Do you have a, a lost love, like the one that got away? No, I don't. No. 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 There's no lost love. Not at all. I'm Asian, we don't talk about these things. I don't think I've ever been in love. I wish. I wish. They kind of all get away. That's kind of my um, forte. I'm probably the love that got away. I'm the one that got away. I got away from them all. I'm happy to have seen all the ones that have gotten away leave. All the boys that I thought were cute when I was little are dusty as hell now. I'd say the only lost love I really have are these uh, LeBron 8 preheats that I had. I was going through a hard time in life and I had to sell them. Um, I had stayed in line for like 10 hours to get these shoes. As soon as I get them again, they're staying with me. Do you have a lost love? It was sophomore year of high school. I was in high school. She was my lab partner. He was a junior. I was a freshman, obsessed with him. I was always too shy to do anything about it. He was either always involved with somebody, or if he wasn't, then I was. I emailed him, like writing out a novel of how much like I fell for him and how much I like him, and if and when he's ready to come out, like let me know, like we can make it work. He's now married to a guy in Chicago, so I was right. Tell me about the one that got away. That person who would have been the one that got away um, was also the one that came back. The person that got away came back. I trapped the one. No one is escaped me. <laughs> this relationship I'm in now is like the real deal. Kept the one that I knew I was gonna be with. I met my husband, we started to dance together and it was never stopped. <laughs> Do you have a lost love? Oh man, that's a few, how much time you got? <laughs> There's a lot. I had an eight year long, long distance relationship, finally met in person, three months after, it's done. High school, we're trying to be together. Parents were against us, school were against us. Why weren't you guys allowed to date? Because in, in China, like, before you go to college, dating just not allowed. What's she at now? You know, I had to deactivate my Facebook account because I would not do work at work because I would try to Facebook stalk her. So I don't know the answer to that question. But I go in incognito and then I like look at their LinkedIn. I think that she's living in LA now. He's a doctor now and he makes a ton of money. Because she's about to be a doctor, I'm like, damn. And now he's famous, so. Who is he? I'm not telling you, he's famous. Do you stay in contact with him? Right now we're not talking, so. We talk, but not as often as we used to. None of his girlfriends want him to talk to me. And then we talked again, and she was like a bitch. And I was like, oh, I remember you being a bitch, shorty? You ain't that cute. Now I'm kind of glad that that didn't happen. I really like my life right now. I'm glad that he got away. I'm over it. You can only take so much rejection and heartbreak before it's time to let go. And he actually just got engaged to a woman. I like will check in on him just to see if he's still married. <laughs> yeah, they're married now. Okay, so 
there. They're not, that's not an option anymore. No, not well, who's to say? We'll see. The door is always open for him. Anything you want to say to them? What if he sees this? Because I don't want to seem crazy. Taylor Christensen, if you're out there, you're the one who got away. At the time, you broke my heart, Kate. Hi, Louie. I hope you're doing good. Hey, Jamie, if you see this, hit me up. Yeah, text me. I had the hots for you. I wish I had told you that I had a crush on you. Hi, Tyler. If we're both single and when we're in our 50s, let's have a baby. Hey, DJ, if you're out there and you're watching, I wonder how things would be different. I'm on Instagram, smiling underscore A-V-I. I'd love to meet up, trade Pokemon cards again, and just catch up on all the lost years.